It's Mandy Lager from Edwards Pharmacy, and this is Around Town with Mandy. I personally have stopped at the coolest place in town, the Icy Delight Snowball Stand. That's right, warm summer days, summer, summer is upon us, and we are getting ready to find out the scoop on the Snowball Stand. here with Nicole she is the owner and we're gonna find out exactly how this little snowball stand all started hey Nicole how are you good how are you great so, so give us the scoop of exactly how this little snowball hut started yeah so I actually worked for the previous owners of the snowball stand when I was in high school and then I bought it from them my senior year in 2000 I guess it was my junior year, 2008, and it was a way to help pay for our college tuition. So now I'm graduated, have a real job, and Kathleen is taking over now to help pay for her college. So we, have a little, we should always joke that we should rename it College Fun Snowballs. <laughs> there you go, Garrett, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, good. So did you ever think that you would be paying for college running a snowball stand? No, <laughs> never. And it's the funnest thing to do, though. Yeah. It's the funnest way to pay for school. <laughs> Definitely. I work in Centerville, and there's always a line at the snowball stand. Yeah. Oh, everybody's yep. waiting for it to open up. Mm -hmm. So the girls are going to show us exactly from start to finish how to create a snowball. This is our, it's just an ice shaving machine. We put 10 pound blocks of ice in here that are big squares, and then there's blades in here that shave it off. Got it. So as you can see, it is creating shaved ice. Yep, yep. So, and then to make the tops, we put this little cup and fill it up with ice. And then we do the bottom part. What's your favorite flavor? Favorite flavor. Let's go uh, cotton candy. All right, cotton candy. Oh, that's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> that's a popular one, too. And then we put the little topper on. That takes talent. Did you see that? That is wonderful. <laughs> Years of practice. And bam, super easy. Perfect. Look at that. One perfect <laughs> cotton candy yep. snowball. <laughs> Tons of flavors, as you can see. What are some odd flavors that someone come in and request? I think the weirdest one that we actually get occasionally is spearmint and chocolate mixed together. Or spearmint and grape. Which, and the That's spearmint and chocolate is kind of, people say, like a peppermint patty, but to me, when you actually mix it, and it doesn't taste like a peppermint <laughs> patty. <laughs> and probably, what's the most popular flavor? Hands down, 10 to 1. Hands down, a custard. Especially Every with marshmallow. Time. Especially with marshmallow. Everyone likes a custard and marshmallow. So you can add toppings to the snowballs. Yes. yes. We have marshmallow toppings, and we have nerd toppings. So we used to have kids who always wanted to get sprinkles, but you can't really put sprinkles on a snowball. Right? So we have nerds. <laughs> Wonderful. Nicole, now that school's out, what can, what are the hours of the stand that people can stop by? So we'll be open 11 to 8, Monday through Saturday, and 12 to 5 on Sundays. Perfect. So remember, the sun is shining, the day is gorgeous, and if you're looking for the coolest place to be, right next to Western Auto at the Snowball Stand. I just want to thank the girls for letting us stop in, and I'm going to enjoy my snowball. We'll see you next week. Bye.